Question 25. In the xy plane, the graph of the equation y equals minus x squared plus 9x minus 100 intersects the line y equals c at exactly one point. What is the value of c? Now, this particular graph is a parabola because it's uh, it's got x squared there. It's a second degree um, graph, so it's a parabola. It starts with a negative leading coefficient, negative one. So this graph will open down. It will look like this. Okay, now whatever C happens to be, now they give us a hint it's a negative number, but let's say I did not know that. Let me just draw a rough sketch of what the question is even asking. The question is saying if you had a parabola, Y equals C could just be this line here that goes through the number C, and this line here would be Y equals C. Well, we could just draw the line, but this is Y equals C. Okay. This line would hit the parabola twice the way I drew it. Now, there is a way to hit the parabola once if you go right through the vertex. That's one intersection. And of course, uh, let me extend this a bit. If you draw the line here, if C were here, uh, you would not hit the parabola at all. You would have you would have no intersection points. So what we have is a case of one intersection point. So what we have is that this line goes through the vertex. We have a we have a line here. Um, C is somewhere here. In truth, C is a negative number because they told us that in the options. But in reality, we wouldn't know that until we took a closer look at the problem. But this line here goes through the vertex of our parabola. It goes through the vertex of the parabola. This parabola has, the vertex has some coordinate and then C because it, the, the Y corner of the vertex is this exact number. Any corner on this line, any Y corner on this line is C, right? Even here, the Y coordinate is C and here the Y coordinate is C. So this has some X coordinate that we don't know and then some Y coordinate. And they're asking us for what the value of this is. So let's go find the vertex of this particular parabola. If you recall, the way you find the vertex is x equals negative b over 2a. And that's the x corner of the vertex. And in this particular case, uh, if you look at this equation, the a is negative 1 right there next to the x squared. The b is 9. The b is positive 9. And the c is negative 100. We don't use that uh, in this formula. We just need the a and the b. So let's go ahead and do that. x equals now it's negative b over 2a. OK, let's be very careful. The b is 9, so that goes here. And the a is negative 1, so that goes here. This ends up being negative 9 over negative 2, or simply, sorry, or simply 9 over 2. OK, but that is this x coordinate, 9 over 2. We need the y coordinate, which is what happens when you plug in nine halves into the original equation. So for that, let's get the calculator out. So we have negative x squared, but x is nine over two. So let's go ahead and put that in, nine over two squared plus nine x. And again, x is nine over two. So you have nine over two minus 100. Negative x squared plus 9x minus 100, where the x coordinate we will be using is 9 halves, 9 over 2. And you get an answer of negative 319 over 4. So this coordinate here is negative 319 over 4, which is option C. So the answer is C.